In 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 18, which is the last verse in that book of 2 Peter, it says, But grow in grace and in the knowledge of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. To him be glory both now and forever. Amen. How much do you really know about Jesus Christ? Do you know him very well or just a little? God has recorded all these things in the Bible so we can understand who Jesus Christ is. I understand that some people read the Bible very little and they understand very little. And there's other people who say, oh, I know Jesus Christ. But that last verse as Peter challenged the people that he wrote this letter to, he says, you understand a certain amount about Jesus Christ, but please keep learning more. He is your Savior. He is your Lord. And it's important that we understand who he is. So here in this letter that P Peter wrote, the second letter, these people who had lived a long time ago, had experienced false teachers. They would get up even in their church or in their area and they would stand and explain all these imagined doctrines. But whether it was them that lived long ago or us today, when we know who Jesus Christ is and we see someone explaining something different from that, we understand immediately that's false. But we have to be careful. Don't let people who stand and tell about what their view of Christ is different from the Bible, we should not swallow that easily because we can get off track very quickly. We just need to learn to spot who the false teacher is in and say, I'm sorry, I'm not interested, and let them go. You know, through various churches in history, there have always been false teachers that try to sway the people away from the truth. But as we have the Bible and we study it and we learn about who Jesus Christ is, then when we see a false teacher or hear their teaching, we can automatically know this does not agree with the Bible. And then perhaps as you learn more about Christ, when you have the opportunity to stand and be the leader or teacher in a church, you will be careful to teach what is right and not be swayed by a false doctrine. So keep it up. Learn more and more about Christ.